We're very positive on the budget. We've been very hard on the government, so we think it's only fair to give them credit where due. They've shown the discipline to get back to a balanced budget. We certainly support the increase in the tax-free savings account limit. We think that's an excellent deal vehicle for Canadians. Uh, empowers them to make decisions about what's best for them and their families rather than leaving it to government. So we see leaving that money in the pockets of Canadians to be a good thing. Uh, you know, we're also supportive, obviously, of the, the cut in small business taxes. We think tax cuts are good, that they do create jobs and generate economic activity. There's a couple of things that uh, we're pleased to see. Uh, the first is the ongoing commitment to lower corporate tax uh, rates. Uh, the government has lowered the overall rate uh, starting uh, several years ago. We're seeing that the commitment to lower rates for small businesses, uh, in uh, such as independent retailers across the country, that it was announced in today's budget is something we welcome. Uh, independent retails are the backbone of many uh, communities across the country, and uh, we believe that as money is put back in their pockets, they'll be able to reinvest in, in jobs, serving uh, consumers uh, on the main streets of communities across the country. Well, there is a lot in this budget for seniors. Our members will be very pleased that a lot of attention has been paid to the concerns that they have had, especially saving for their own retirement. Remember, these are modest income seniors who need to make every dollar count. We're also very pleased to see the uh, new um, renovation tax credit, which will make a great deal of difference helping people stay in their own homes. And of course, the most important thing, I think, is the uh, new enhanced uh, EI Compassionate Leave benefit that expands to six months, which is going to be really welcome for a lot of people now who have to look after loved ones. The small business stuff is very good. 700 companies across the country, uh, 500 of them in the aerospace are small business. The reduction in the cor corporate income tax will certainly help. Access to my, uh, new financing through the Financing Act, these are all great things for the aerospace industry in Canada. You know, and what we've seen in today's budget is certainly a commitment to the Market Access Secretariat for the next two years, as well as the Trade Commissioner's Office in the markets that we need to get into, specifically Korea, as well as the new developing market in the EU. As cities become bigger and a dominant part of our economy, moving people around is just common sense. And you look at some of the challenges that we experience in Metro Vancouver, in Toronto, Montreal, uh, you know, this is a great announcement. Um, and I, I, it's one of those things in a budget that I, I think is uh, understated because it will impact people's daily lives uh, once implemented.